Hey guys, um, my name is Cameron Simpson, CS Trades. I, I'm not a stockbroker or an advisor. So that means I uh, take everything with a grain of salt. So today I'm going over uh, some Canadian stocks, a company out of Waterloo. Um, and uh, yeah, it's called Blackberry. BB on the symbol. Okay, the ticker symbol. So I'm just going to go over um, awesome company. Okay, I think they're... I think they're undervalued personally um, they had a good run today um, they're down low <clears throat> let's go back here Look at these W's oh yeah always a push after a W eh? so they say Blackberry yesterday was up quite a bit I think it was up six percent uh, then it dove today um, the markets were down yesterday um, everywhere uh, just see a red a couple of them in the green um, Loop Energy, Air Canada. I will get into those uh, some other time. I made, a couple of people made some comments. They want me to cover that. So I definitely will be covering that. So I want to get into BlackBerry right now. I want to get in BlackBerry actually about their news. Okay. BlackBerry news. Um, this is why I think they're undervalued. And yes, I do have, uh, I, I do own uh, stock in this. So I want to tell you that they have um, some software that is uh, used for, um, it's run through Android and what it is is um, <clears throat> they can actually operate the vehicle with you in it or not okay it's called QNX 2.2 okay and it's uh, embedded software and what it does is um, it's awesome it's it's uh, it's like uh, with Tesla how they can control everything like that but way better and they also have good security out the government uses it uh, uh, all over the world it's used for uh, the medical services they make a lot of medical machines now they're not a software or a mobile company anymore they used to be years ago uh, Blackberry um, used to have like a texting um, platform it was really good ahead of its times and um, from there it has turned into a company that has expedited and uh, has lots of uh, like I said the software inside the car it's uh, I forget how many millions of vehicles it's coming um, out in but uh, uh, self-driving trucks uh, with Amazon robotics huge way undervalued I think this is a $50 stock um, it got caught up in that reddit and spiked it I think uh, uh, people don't recognize it and they thought it was a losing stock before it was like down very low very low and that's why there's a big sellout uh, with the people that were like up high up in the company they sold out that's why you see chunks coming out okay i think that in the next as soon as this COVID thing's over i think that this stock is going to skyrocket okay that's why me and my wife have bought shares in this and i think we're very 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 in a good very, very good place okay so that's with blackberry i just wanted to go through that uh with you uh we'll check the charts out here i just wanted to check some go back here just a bit I just want to check up the pivot points here. Okay, lines of resistance uh, par here. It's at a uh, uh, buck twenty-four. <clears throat> I think that this is just my personal opinion. I think that um, it's perfect buying time for this, guys. And like, I'm not a financial supervisor, but if, like I said, if it was me, I would buy. I did buy because I know after this pandemic, sky's the limit, man. This thing's gonna skyrocket, especially if, if uh, like Tesla. Or, or, or like Ford or these companies pick up this software which they're running a bunch of pilot projects right now okay guys so yeah um, thanks for tuning in to uh, to CS trades 101 Cameron Simpson and if you could hit the subscribe button makes a huge difference for us and um, and hitting a like is even just as good okay guys that's the end of my video and you guys have a great day